Hello viewers, welcome to Engineering Study Materials. Today we are going to discuss about the reaction centering or reaction bonding process. This is a suitable process for the processing of the ceramic matrix composites or the dense coal and ceramics. First, reaction bonded silicon nitrate. It is made of from a finely divided silicon powders and reacted with a mixed nitrogen or hydrogen nitrogen helium atmosphere at 1200 to 1250 degrees celsius the nitrogen permeates that is it intrudes the porous body and reacts with the silicon to form silicon nitrate within the pores then it is reheated to 1400 degrees celsius and precise control is exercised over the nitrogen flow rate and heating rate then it forms the ceramic so that we can get the near net shape process then reaction bonded silicon carbide it is produced from a finely divided mixture of silicon carbide and carbon Pieces formed from the mixture are exposed to liquid or a vapor silicon at high temperature. The silicon reacts with the carbon to form the additional silicon carbide which bonds the original particles together. Silicon also fills any residual open pores and like our reaction bonded silicon nitride reaction bonded silicon carbide undergoes little dimensional change during sintering. That is when heated its dimensions shrinks. Product exhibit virtually constant strength at temperature rise to melting point of the silicon. Then the, in this process it has an advantage that problems with the matrix shrinkage during its densification is minimized. Then silicon cloth is prepared by attrition milling a mixture of silicon powder, a polymer binder and a organic solvent to obtain a dough of proper consistency this dough is then rolled in a rolling machine to make a silicon cloth then fiber mats are made by filament winding of silicon carbide with a fugitive binder then the fiber mats and silicon cloth are stacked in an alternate sequence that is the mats are stacked either in the zero degree or 0 degree, 45 degree and 90 degree alternatively so that we can uh, get a high strength uh, stack of poly stack of uh, composite then de binderized and hard pressed in a molybdenum dye in a nitrogen or a vacuum environment at this stage the silicon matrix is converted to the silicon nitride by transferring the composite to a nitriding furnace between 1100 to 1400 degrees celsius typically the silicon nitride matrix has about 30 percent porosity which is not ex unexpected in the reaction model silicon nitride then advantages are large volume fractions of the whisker are reinforcement and multi-directional strength properties continuous fiber performs can be used fiber degradation can be avoided then disadvantages are uh, it has high porosity that is quite difficult to avoid so this is the short video friends about the reaction bonded sintering process uh, so if you like this video please click the thumbs up button and share this video to your friends to gain knowledge and don't forget to subscribe this channel for more videos so thank you for watching